What's up guys, Blavy Gaming, and today I am playing Nightmare Today. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Let's get right into it. I'm gonna do normal, obviously. Because I'm not a crazy person. And I would like to have a normal experience. Oh hey, weather guy. No, 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 no. Twenty-three year old Judith uh, Glasslow was reported missing yesterday evening. She described as a Caucasian, five feet seven inches tall, with a slim build and long brown hair. She was last seen entering her apartment after being escorted home by friends following a late night out clubbing. Police searched her apartment and interviewed neighbors, but have been able to un uh, unable to find any clues leading to her current whereabouts. Most friends and relatives say that Glasslow had been complaining about frequent nightmares and hallucinations in the days before she went missing. It is unknown if these had anything to do with her disappearance. Laszlo is the latest in an alarming number of recent disappearances that have local residents spooked. Authorities say they have been all over 10 missing people reported in just the past week. Police have been unable to find any new leads in the investigation of the disappearances and implore anyone with information to call the missing persons investigation unit at... Turn off the TV. You've been having a terrible nightmares recently, and watching the news about these disappearances is just going to make them worse. It's getting late. You're feeling pretty tired. You should eat dinner and take a shower before going to bed. You're pretty sure that there was a leftover slice of pizza in the fridge. All right, leftover pizza. I'm too tired to play games right now. Oh, but I want to play that game. That actually looks like a decent game. Oh, cool, there's saves. The door doesn't look creepy at all. Anyway, it told me to eat and shower, so... Mmm, pizza. Who puts the bananas in the fridge? Use it to eat up food. Here we go. Yeah, the good stuff. 420, baby. That's the time. That's how you cook the pizza right. Like a nice, hot, steamy, greasy pizza. Even though, honestly, cooking in the microwave doesn't make it taste as good as it used to. You could just sort of, like, put it on the stove in a pot, and it would probably taste much better. Might. But, you know. Not too shy. Oh, I look so beautiful in the mirror! Look how pretty I am. Alright, time to take a shower. It's gonna get nice and steamy. I care if your legs hot showers. All clean. It's time to go to bed. What? How do the TV turn on by itself? Just turn it off. As soon as you turn off the TV, suddenly notice the reflection of the TV screen that there's someone standing behind your sofa. Oh, hey, buddy! You turn around and see a large man staring at you with a crazy smile on his face. His hoarse breathing echoes throughout the room. The man's holding a decapitated head of a woman. Thoughts of a recent disappearance has come to mind and culture runs up your spine. And the next moment, the man fades away just as suddenly as he appeared. You must be more tired than you thought if you're starting to hallucinate. Maybe eating that pizza go before going to bed was not the best of ideas. A good night's sleep should help you refresh your mind. I hope you don't have another nightmare tonight. Yeah, come on, man. Alright. Time to sleep. Welcome to Nightmare of Decay. Oh, cool, I'm in a coffin. Oh, I got out. Let's go. Budge, I'll need to find another way out of this place. Well, obviously, the basement's gonna be safe. Hey, cat. Let me pet you. 
See cat sitting on the railing at the top of the stairs. It uh, stares at you with unnaturally intelligent eyes. Hello, stranger. What? You can talk? Cat greets you, and strangely enough, you can understand what it is saying. Looks like the nightmare has claimed yet another victim. Many have been through here against their will, only to meet a terrible end one way or another. No one has ever managed to escape alive. The cat pauses to look you up and down, almost as it if to appraise you of your work, it seems unimpressed. wonder how long you'll be able to survive for. Not long, if I had to make a guess. It'll be fun to see how you meet your end in this horrible place. Maybe one of those monsters will get you. Or maybe you'll go insane and end yourself. Well, I need you to get going. Good luck, stranger. Try not to die too fast. Knife. It's a weapon to defend myself with. I will take it. Doors held by a rusty old padlock. You should probably break the lock if I hit it with something. Tab. Survival knife. Ooh. Just real quick, I'm just gonna assume that this door over here is locked. Yeah. Okay. Just had to double check. See if there's a better way in. There's not. What you eating on, buddy? Does it taste good? Like McDonald's? Maybe like a fine cuisine? A key! I need that key! And a gun? I need it! Hey! Back up! Back up! Zombie. It's a crouch button in this game. I think there is one. Oh, I'm gonna take this. Take this. Cool. Key to the entrance of the manor. Okay, so I've got a gun and I've got a knife. I feel a lot more safe now that I have weapons. I think I'll live a lot longer now. Stupid cat, thinking I was gonna die quickly. Now I'm gonna live a long time. Ooh, spooky. It's a big house. A lot of nice artwork. Hey, a save point! I am going to definitely save here. Heals, and ammo, and save. Alright. Okay. Got quiet all of a sudden. Not sure if I like that. Coin chain exam. There are a number of coins shaped indents above the fireplace. An old farmer, tired from a day of hard labor, falls asleep under the shade of a tree while his loyal dog watches over him. Okay. More gun ammo, nice. Empty jar for something. Acid rep recipe, okay. Access to some of the areas of the manor have been obstructed by a strange fleshy growth. Lord William has tasked me with finding a solution to this issue. I discovered that a mixture of containing equal amounts of uh, lanum, uh, ozone, and aqua verum can be used to create a Corrosive acid that can dissolve the fleshy growth and regain access to poorly obstructed areas. Good to know. I don't think I have said things, but you know, that's fine. Oh, wonderful. You know, I I enjoy the taste of a. Uh, Door to the pantry, the faint stench of raw meat is going to find it. 
try to open it, but it won't budge. After a moment, a rough voice suddenly calls out to you from the other side. Is someone there? Please, I need help. I accidentally locked myself in here, and I can't get back out. I've been stuck in here. My pre precious collection has been rotting away. I must escape so I can add fresh toys to it. Please, we can help each other. You wish to get in, and I wish to get out. The key to the door should be somewhere in the manor. It's a large blue key with the word pantry carved into it. Please hurry. I do not wish to spend another moment stuck in here. My collection is rotting away. Gun! I stay strapped! Die! Bullets does it take to kill? And I'm out. Took all that just to kill one of you? Okay. Obviously, I'm a little faster. Oh, no! Man, I'm gonna die. I am dead. Cool. Just load this. I'm gonna go... I don't know. Do I still have my old loot? Yeah. Alright, well then I'm just gonna go this way. Because that that's like 20 zombies and I just don't have the loot to kill them all at the moment. What a lock. This seems much better than that room full of stuff. High score. I got a pellet gun. Mainly used for shooting targets. Not effective as an actual weapon. Okay. Come on, there we go. I don't know what that is. Okay. Said so it's not like an actual weapon, so I'll just put it away for now, I guess. Cool pellet game, though. Doors locked. The shape of the spade has been carved into the lock. Okay. Oh, okay. I can break bases. I like that. I like that a lot. Um, well, that's all I can do here. There's a 
that's a death sentence. That's a fun little game. I'm gonna save real quick now that I made some progress here. Let's see, middle door? Middle door. He's outside. Nope! Ah, uh, no. Uh, those are dogs. No. If I can barely survive regular zombies, then there's no way I can survive dogs. Alright, I guess I have to go to the kitchen. I don't have a choice. Let's do it. You know. Look, now I know that you can break these. Very helpful. Alright, let's see here. Cool. Alright. Alrighty. Hey, yada, yada, yada. Bye bye. Oh. Hey. Oh, are you kidding me? I hate this so much. I suck at it. All right. Good thing I saved. Oh man. Good thing I saved indeed. Hard. Need more pistol ammo. I'm gonna need it. Put this stupid thing again, and this stupid thing, and some of this again. Yes, I know. Cool. I'm out. Hey, hey. Hey, I got a health drink, and I got my ammo back. I'll take it. I'm making slow but sure progress. What the? That door was not there before. Um, but okay. I will not complain. Checkpoint never hurt nobody. Where does this go to? Hmm. Yeah, I don't trust this room. I'd like to... I'd like to go and save before I... Mess with that too much. Um... Shotgun! Oh, it's gonna make me use it right away, huh? Ooh. OK. 
Hey, well, now I have a shotgun and a pistol and a knife. Okay, all in all, I'm doing pretty good. Alright. I got a pistol and I'm not afraid to use it. Uh oh, there are two of you. Let's just get one of you to get closer here. There we go. So four bullets if I headshot him. Oh, but it's not guaranteed. Okay. Die! 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 Jesus. Alright, cool. At least I got a health drink out of it. I'll be all right. I'm just gonna guess that was men's, and this is gonna be women's bathroom. No, oh, it's a store. It's a storage unit. Oh, save point. Let's go. Oh, thank God. Progress, baby. That's progress. That's fine. Platformer stuff on the shed, maybe I can throw something heavy down here to dislodge it. Dislodge it. It's an old grandfather clock to be used on lock. Uh, the fake clipper. Okay. Door shaped with a club. <sighs> I kind of screwed it up here. I need to go back. That ladder, I have a feeling, actually, will be used for something. And I think I found said something. Alright, now we just need to figure out. No. Just move it through here. And move it up a bunch. Climb it. Yes, climb through the vent. Sweet. Shoo, shotgun ammo. Okay. And another save point. I will not. I have a feeling there's a reason why he gave me this shotgun ammo. Woo! Woo! Uh oh, run away! Oh. Okay, good. I was gonna say, there's no way he tanks two shotgun shells to the head. No way. Alright. Well, we moved the ladder. 
get to some better some loot. Um, die! Die! You're dead! Stop moving! Uh oh. Oh! No! No! That's four of them. No thanks. It'd be a difference if there were two of them. That is four of them. Alright. Well, I made it back to the main area. So I'm gonna save. I made a lot of progress. This is going to be the end of episode one because I will make this a whole series because it seems like it's a really big, full, fleshed out game. So, if you guys like the video, you already know what to do. You click, you subscribe, you like, and you view the video. And the more views it gets, the more I'll make sure to make a bunch more videos on it. Alright, bye.